So what's up guys, I'm bringing you a video today of me drawing the Crypt Keeper from Tales from the Crypt Keeper cartoon 1993 that was on ABC on Network. It's a spinoff from the main Tales from the Crypt TV show that premiered in 89 and 96 by HBO. I break it down into three parts. I do the pencils, the ink pen, and then I do the coloring segment. I start by picking some good reference. I decided to pick the, the uh, Crypt Keeper because it's about, you know, Halloween time guys. <laughs> Okay, let's jump right in here. I go ahead and start by choosing the pencil tool. It's a little bit softer than the pen tool at first. That's why I choose this. And you kind of rough in your blueprint sketch here like I'm doing. Um, that's why it's kind of nice to pick something simple like the Crypt Keeper, this older stuff here. Because you can just kind of do something quick with the pencils to practice. Then you can go to step two and start inking and then you can learn how to color. Usually comic books have people do all three separate processes. They have a penciler and an inker and a color. Okay, now we're going on to the coloring, or excuse me, the inking section. <clears throat> and this is kind of where it starts to get fun. This is where the drawing starts to stiffen up, so you gotta be careful. When you start solidifying the lines around what you've drawn, it'll start to look really stiff, and you have to be careful here. This is where, using digital software comes in handy because you can go back, you can refine, you can erase within the layer and you don't have to mess up like your pencils. Like in case you did a really nice pencil sketch and then your ink pen inking doesn't look that good, you can kind of correct that within the digital software because it's on its own separate layer, which really helps. Okay, so now we're going on here to the coloring portion. Of course, this is where the whole thing comes to life. The whole thing just comes alive here. It's awesome. Um, this can be a really fun process, and this can be where you destroy the whole thing, I think. I mean, I think you can risk that during the whole creation of art. Here, you can kind of bring it to life by choosing colors. Here, I kind of went back to my slime theme, but this time instead of doing pink slime, I chose the green slime since it's, it's the Crypt Keeper to kind of match his theme. And here he is, this is almost about the final work here. Gonna have the slime dripping down. All, all I do, all, all I can hear is this guy laughing in the back of my head. But he, this, this process is subject to how you really wanna make it look. Like I could have made it a 3D painting, but I kinda wanted to keep it in this cartoon format. But here's the finished piece. Hope you guys enjoyed the video today. Thank you for coming, and just stay tuned for more stuff from uh, Adam Genesis Art.